Hello and welcome to Culture This Too. My name is Gregory Moses. I am your professor for this course. And the purpose of this video is to help online students orient themselves and make sure you can find everything you need in order to succeed in this class. So here we are in the course home. Here is where this video is. If you scroll down a bit, you'll find the syllabus. You should read the syllabus. This video is not intended to replace it or to give you information that is already in the syllabus. Scroll down further, and you'll find our learning material. This is an asynchronous online course. What that means is that you're not going to be joining my lectures via Zoom or anything like that. Instead, you'll go to our course sub pages and find learning materials there. So every week, new sub pages will open up. You don't see anything in week two right now, but on the 17th, Monday at midnight, new units will open up. Let's click on one of these units that's already open and take a look. All of the units are structured in basically the same way. There's a brief intro video. There are learning outcomes. There is the textbook section. And online students are expected to make use of the textbook. And then there is additional learning material that I've created. So videos and written notes. And you might not make use of all of this. Maybe you'll read the textbook and understand everything and do the homework and not need additional material, and that's perfectly fine. But if you do need help with any topic, you can find um, that help here. Once you have read the textbook, and watch the, any videos or read any notes that you want to, you'll find the homework down here. This is making the class look more crowded than it really is, because this first week we have two special assignments. There's a self-introduction in the forums, and there's a syllabus assignment to ensure that you take my advice and really do read the syllabus. Usually there will be just two things a textbook assignment, and then a link to the forums if you have questions about the section or about the homework that you want to ask me. So let's click on this textbook assignment. You can see the problems that I want you to do. I actually have already submitted something for this, though. So let me go to the syllabus quiz so that I can demonstrate how homework is submitted. The syllabus quiz, you can submit answers as text but that's not how you'd submit um, textbook assignments. Instead, you'd do the assignments on a piece of paper, 
and you would photograph or scan them. And once you have your answers as image files or PDFs on your computer, you would upload them to CSC Online using this browse button. Select whatever you want to upload, press open, and voila. And you see that if you have multiple pages, you can repeat that process as many times as you want. And when you're all done, press submit. And now I'll be able to see it and comment on it. If you're having trouble with an assignment, you can ask for help. So let's say you're doing section 4.7 and you're struggling with something, you can go to the forums and You'd start a new conversation, type in whatever you're having trouble with, type your question, and then post it. And I look at the forums at least once a day, so I should get back to you pretty promptly. You can also, if you prefer, email me with questions using this messages tab, compose a message, select me as the recipient, type your, um, whatever your subject line is, type your question, press send, it will be forwarded straight to my inbox. And I think you are now ready to get started. As I mentioned earlier, the first thing you want to do is to read the syllabus. After you have done that, you can go to assignments and complete the syllabus assignment, then dive into the mathematical material. If you have questions, feel free to get in touch. And all that remains for now is for me to say that I hope you have an enjoyable and productive semester.